Hey guys, welcome back to the Cosmetics YouTube channel. I'm Kai, long time no see, and I am here today to unbox Essence Newness. I'm so excited. And let's put on this beautiful face together with all the brand new Essence products. Keep watching to see what is in my fun little magic box over here. I am so excited to go through this box. So let's go through it and see what goodies we have inside. So first things first, we have these hydro patches that I absolutely am so excited to try. So this has a cooling effect, it's hydrating, and it has hyaluronic acid in it, which really helps plump the skin up. And I really love putting these on before makeup, so like during my skin prep. So everything just goes on nice and smooth, and I don't have any under eye bags, and it's not puffy, um, and everything just goes on beautifully. Look how pretty these are, and they're kind of like iridescent. Love that. So these are kind of jelly feeling, and a little tip that I do like to tell people is if you leave these in the fridge, they'll get so nice and cool and they'll like double that cooling effect that you get, which is just so lovely and it really keeps you like nice and awake. So that is a fun little thing that I like to do. You just chuck these in your fridge and then when you're ready to use them, you chuck them on and divide. So I'm gonna let these sit for like 10 to 15 minutes and then I will be right back. First, we are gonna start off with this Bright Eyes Under Eye Brightener. So this comes in a little tube and as you can see, there is so much product in this. This is gonna last a very long time. So I'm just gonna twist this up a bit and just kind of put this under my eye. Just like that. This product would be perfect for under your makeup or just by itself, honestly. You just put a little bit on your finger, tap it under there, kind of like a brightening concealer. And that is the Bright Eyes and Eye Stick. So I am back and I've prepped my skin. So now let's get into the other makeup products. So to blush and bronze, we are going to go in with this brand new Bloom Baby Bloom face and eye palette. And I'm so, so excited to try this out. Guys, it looks so cute. So this opens up long ways, just like this. And here we have all our shades. Very nice and neutral, a super nice basic palette to have and everything is all in one. All your neutrals over here for your eyeshadows and then we have a highlighter, a blush and a bronzer. So you can just put this in your bag and you have one product for your whole face essentially. So we're gonna go in with quite a big brush and really put that bronzer on and let's see how pigmented it is. Oh. Stunning. I love that. Cool. So we're just going to lightly go in there. As you can see, it's quite pigmented. So I'm just going to really just start to bring some more color back into my face. To tone it down a little because it is very pigmented, we are going to just go in with a clean brush and just really buff that in. And look at that. Absolutely stunning. I love that color. So pigmented. I didn't even need to use a lot and it is the bronzer So now let's go into the blush to just marry these two together. It's quite a dark blush. It's not a bright pink blush so it'll give you more of a rosy look rather than something too sweet and pink Ooh. Again insanely pigmented, so we're just gonna rub that in so now we're gonna go in with the highlights and see what we can do with that. I'm not a huge highlighter girl. I don't like to put on too much, but I like to look glowy. I like to sparkle in the sun. So we're gonna do that. So I'm just gonna put my finger in here. And I like to highlight on the bridge of my nose up here. And on the tip of my nose. So for the eyeshadows, I'm not going to use these. We're going to go in with another palette, which is so super exciting. Welcome to Cape Town. Ah! Look at these stunning colors inspired 
by an African safari, Cape Town vibes, Table Mountain vibes. So I'm really battling on deciding what color to use. So we're just gonna do a quick swatch on a few that I think I wanna use. As you can see, I did a little swatch and I'm definitely thinking about we're going on with the blues, but I'm not too sure. I don't wanna do something too hectic. So I think we're just gonna play around and see what happens. This pigment is insane. So I'm gonna take this fluffy brush with this blue in the corner over here. Remember to tap off that excess. And we're just gonna go in on the lid and kind of just smoke that out. It's kind of like a denim shade, like jeans, like a jean denim -y shade. So we're just gonna do a quick little blue moment on the lids. And then we're gonna go in with this angled brush and take this dark blue, this one that is over here, that is this shade over here. Um, and I'm just gonna kind of line the outer corners of my eye to just give some depth, you know? I'm gonna go in more with the dark blue and just kind of go in on those corners, just make it a bit darker. And then we're gonna get a clean brush and paint it out again. Kind of like that and like that and just kind of mix it around and go in the inner corner of the eye in that first bit to just add a bit of sparkle with the finger. So the reason I'm using my finger is just because the pigment really pays off a lot better with your finger than it does on a brush when it comes to shimmer. So this is what it is currently looking like and I have the perfect next product to add on top of this look to really give us mermaid vibes. So I'm really thinking the theme of this video is like mermaids because we started off with these little hydro patches and they've got the little mermaid tails on them and it says be a mermaid and we chose the blue eyes and now we're going in with some multi-chrome flakes to really just top it off with some sparkle and pizzazz. So this is an eyeshadow topper. It is basically just a clear gel with some flakes in it and you're gonna see now. So it says no fallout and it is self setting. So once it's on, it'll dry down and just stay there. We're just gonna take it out the little box. And it's such an interesting shape, the packaging. You can see it's kind of like square. And I'm just gonna pop that on the lid. Look how pretty that is. That is stunning. This would be perfect for festivals and Halloween and if you're just a sparkly girl, if you're a sparkly person actually, then this is the stuff for you. It is fantastic and it doesn't even feel like it's on. It just dries down super nice and then you just take it off with makeup remover like you do with the rest of your makeup. So the next product we are going to go in with is this Lash Without Limits Extreme Lengthening Volume Mascara. So let's put Lash Without Limits to the test. So essentially what I like to do is you look down, so you take the mirror, you look down and you kind of start at the root and really work your way up in there. I mean, it's crazy. One swipe and the entire lash is covered. This is such a nice mascara and it's not clumpy, which is divine. Today, we're gonna go in with an insanely, insanely exciting product and this is the new Essence Hydra Kiss Lip Oil. So today we're gonna go in with this light pink, almost clear one and let's see the finish. Look at that already. Stunning, oh my gosh. It feels actually like luxurious to put on. It's very like, it's thick, but it's not sticky. You know, like it's there. Um, I definitely feel like there is a lip oil on my lips, but it is Oh, there but barely there, you know. Oh, it smells so good.
Thank you so much for watching me unbox my little box of goodies from Essence and put on this beautiful face of makeup. I am so excited for you guys to try this makeup. Honestly, my mind is blown. I love Essence products, always have, always will. Newness has just landed, so you can get it on www.houseofcosmetics.co.za. You need to go get some of these products. Um, you can go see all the newness on House of Cosmetics, and I will link that down below. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.